about being up here is an opportunity to, to really share. And, and, and every single poet who comes up here at this microphone, when you are here, you are the featured poet of the evening. You have the power to do whatever you want to do. And that's part of what it's all about. I was asking Vivian if she remembered the poetry readings down in Norman, and man, they, they would take you out back. You know, sometimes. <laughs> and that's, that's kind of what this has not been about. So, you know, I, I want to say that, you know, I ain't really been indulging myself when I'm showing out. I know I'm showing out, as my mom would say, but I'm doing it to let you know when you get up here, it's your opportunity to show out too, when we're not showing out. So when you leave here, you can get it out of your system. You can go down and bother and show out and get in trouble. Because, like uh, J.J. Kale said, you know, uh, they don't care about Dallas, Texas, they don't care about Wichita. In Oklahoma, you got to move around a lot. So when you get up here, <laughs> it's your opportunity to do and say, do your thing. And that's what's beautiful about this. And I just want to make that clear. I know I'm showing out on purpose, and I'm trying to encourage you, every one of you all, to not hold back to do the very same thing. And I appreciate Bill pointing that out because he's showing out too. You know, the ball too, anyway. <laughs> So my seven-year-old grandson, William, said last week, Papa, spiders are controlling my mind and they make me do bad things and I don't like it. So I asked his mom about that. He had just been grounded a week and he has discovered a way to blame his misbehavior on, in this case, Spiders. Spiders made him do bad things, and he doesn't like it. And he is so sweet. Gosh. Okay, who's next? Very good. Keep them counting, sir. 